Welcome to this Geek Tyrant Versus. Today we got a very special episode for you. We are going to be doing the Spider Versus Special. Gwen, Spidey Gwen versus Silk. On Team Gwen we have... Corinne. Danny. And on Team Silk we have... Mandy. Aaron. All right, let's get this thing started off with a uh, rock, paper, scissors. Oh my God. Yeah. Really happened again. Yay. Interesting how All that right. works. Silk is going first. <laughs> Silk's going to go first. Okay. Timer is set. Go. All right. Well, wouldn't it be interesting if there was someone out there who could be the queen of all the spider women and all the spider men? Oh, wait, there is a queen. Her name is Silk. Silk. <laughs> but don't worry, we won't make you bow down to us just yet. Um, so Silk is very intelligent. She did well in school. She was on the fact uh, channel. Um, she was gifted and talented in school. She had an amazing memory. She played hockey, which shows she has strategy. And her webs are awesome. Yeah, her webs are completely organic. She's able to make claws out of them, which are extremely strong. And she's also being able to make her own costume on the go. Spider-Man, he didn't even think of that. Yeah, and having the two fingers to make the yeah. webs. We get more intricate designs. We can do more. I mean, come on. like She's faster than Black Cat. She's able to defeat black cat multiple times and she's just a more interesting character in general you always just want to read more and more about her mm -hmm. so she's, she's stronger so depth. Mm -hmm. she's got an amazing background so she's she's better all right time <laughs> sure sure Ooh, okay right. shots fired on silk side <laughs> right what do we got from the gwen side all right timer ready <laughs> Go. All right, so you say that Gwen has such a great, or that Silk has such a great backstory and everything. Fantastic. She spent most of that in a bunker. So really all of that <laughs> oh, ambition and all of that talent that you're talking about was pretty much spent underground. She's like unbreakable Cindy Moon. Exactly that. <laughs> so when, when you take Cindy out of the bunker, her biggest thing is that you're saying that she can weave her own webs and everything. Well, guess what? Every spider has webs one way or how, another. It's not special. How long was she in that bunker, by the way? Uh, I think it was something like 13 Years? And why? Why was she in that bunker? Because she was scared of one villain, and it was the one place he couldn't find her. She had the code to get out, she just oh, yeah. didn't want oh, to leave. Oh, that's right. And when she did yeah. get out and that's find right. out that that villain was not dead, Morlin BT Dubs, mm -hmm. she mm -hmm. attacks Peter Parker, not once, but twice. What? Oh, yeah, and then she has this pheromone issue where she pretty much just wants to jump Peter's bones. So anytime Peter okay. is around, she just wants. <laughs> Shh, you. She's kind of a skank. One is just better. <laughs> it's just. I don't yeah. know. Like there's no there's not much else you Silk can do. Silk just doesn't know what to do with that. Time. <laughs> it is now time for our rebuttal. We are going to start off with Silk. Are you ready? Yes. Awesome. And go. Well the fact that she wants to jump Spider Man's bones just shows that they have a healthy <laughs> love life together. Right. So that's just she is a well rounded <laughs> individual. And let's um, face it, Spider Man's a hope. <laughs> She's building fair. up her own this little black book. This isn't about me. <laughs> yeah. She has great moral values. She wants to look for her family. It's not about her, and uh, she doesn't have a big ego. She wants to go find her family. That's her mission right there. And the fact that she was in a bunker actually is a strength because she had the willpower to stay in the bunker. She had the codes to leave at any time, but she wanted to stay there for the good of everybody else. So she sacrificed herself and had the strength to just stay there, which is hard because it gets pretty bored in there. Um, and then as far as the Spider-Verse goes, I mean, she's people a, went after her and not, not Gwen. I mean, that mm -hmm. just kind of shows. Yeah, she was a threat. She was she was a big threat. She was the main dish they want to go after. Gwen was just a little French fry. So she was stronger. She's faster than Spider-Man, and she has stronger spider sense. So she's no, amazing. Cut. No, Sorry. No. Okay. Oh, oh. <laughs> That'd be much of me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, are we ready? And go ahead. All right. Half of the shit that happens in Spider-Verse is either indirectly or directly Silk's fault. They have to go back to the Loom World several times just to save people because Silk goes, oh no, I broke my teleporter. I guess I'll take Jessica Drew's. Oh shit, what do you mean we left Jessica Drew in the Loomverse because I took her teleporter? Awesome, now Gwen has to go back and clean up her mess. Classic. That's pretty much what half of Spider-Verse is. Quote from Jessica Drew, Spider-Woman, one of the most long-standing Spider characters. She is irresponsible, naive, 
And what's that third one? Incompetent. That's the next Too one. Bad everyone hates Jessica Gwen Drew. is an original <laughs> character from the Spider-Man series. Everyone loves her. Everybody wanted her to have a spin-off. She's just like a standalone character. She's a strong female character represented in the Spider-Verse, and she's just an original class. In less than a year, Spider-Gwen went from nothing to having her own comic book, talks of a movie, uh, so many cosplayers out there. She got popular so fast. In under a year, most ca characters take so much longer just to get that kind of notoriety. Time! Who is Silk? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Who indeed? Too bad Shots Gwen have so been boring. fired on Who both sides. Indeed. Well, that's what the Geek Tyrant Girls have to say. What do you have to say? Comment and vote below. Check us out. This fun episode. What do you think? <laughs> I think it's Peter Parker's fault. Yeah, it's yeah. a little bit. Yeah. But really, like the girl and girl hate, that's not necessary. Like Silk's a great character, yeah. Gwen's a great character. We're on the same team. Peter has a lot more issues it's all than your both of us. Yeah. yeah, like seriously. Yeah. Yeah. Why are you even yeah. here? Yeah. Yeah. about you. Yeah. Yeah. You should probably leave. Oh. The girls think, yeah, you're, just go. You're leaving just, like just, you always do. Just go back oh to Black God. Cat. Go back over here. Yeah, Black Cat. Seriously, what the heck? Come on. This is awkward, guys. Get out of here, Spider Man.